Finally, the patient James Wilde. Thank you. Mr Deputy Speaker, and I declare an interest as a Norwich City season ticket holder in Kings Lynn Town supporter, and I welcome the White Paper's focus on a sustainable and competitive game. But introducing new regulations should be very much the last resort, so we need to ensure this is a truly proportionate regime. But given the focus on fans, will my rival friend consider proposals to allow non-league clubs who took out sports survival loans, the repayment of which may threaten some of their viability, to convert those loans into equity gifted to supporters' trusts to leave a legacy of greater fan ownership of community clubs? And will he meet me to discuss this? Uh, I thank my hon. Friend for his question. He is right that you know, it is disappointing that we have had to step in here for, uh, to introduce the regulation, uh, but he is also right, and this is why we have taken time, we are ensuring that it is proportionate, uh, because we do not want to put too much pressure, certainly on the clubs that are perhaps lower down the league, but, ex- but do need to make sure that they are run properly. He is asking me to make a spending commitment, which I think my colleagues in Treasury would uh, be extremely cross with me for do- if I committed to do that, but I would be more than happy to meet with him to discuss his proposal. Thank you, Minister. Well, members.